All right, another adventure. So we're out here with uh, King Pete, some of the crew. We're gonna paddle the Haw River. Today is a very special day. Cause I get to try out my new Liquid Logic Flying Squirrel for the first time. My, uh, I let my wife name her. And my wife chose the name Betty, so everybody meet Betty. So hopefully uh, Betty and I take care of each other today. But uh, it's December in North Carolina, so the weather changes from minute to minute. A uh, couple of days ago, it was in the 30s. Now it's in the 60s, figures. Uh, most of the guys brought dry suits. The rookie did not. I have a dry suit, and I was like, it's 60 something degrees. I don't need a dry suit, but uh, so I've got a dry top. So I'm gonna do everything I can to uh, stay upright today. But uh, it's still a beautiful day to be out on the river. Never paddled this section of the haul before. So looking forward to it. We'll see you out there. Good times. Good time. Just like riding a motorcycle, it's always important to keep your eyes on where you want to go on the river. In this particular case, I saw the one lone rock zoned in on it, and as Pete said, like a moth to a flame, I found it. I'm out here, I'm out here. Yes, sir. Get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Yes! Yeah. Yes, sir! Way to play, Pete! Oh yeah, never better. I wasn't giving up. Awesome way to hang, man. <laughs> Other option is to roll. Oh. <laughs> it's usually better that way. <laughs> I should try that next time. Right? Yeah. Got it. Yeah. Nice. I, have... I was like, lean right, lean right. That's what I thought. Of. You're like, hey, I'm drifting into this rock. <laughs> I'm on the rock. I'm, oh, okay. I'm good. Nope. <laughs> Not good. Not good. I was like, I know it's just that rock. You have to match the intensity of the river. Okay. Not overmatch it, but definitely not undermatch it. And a lot of people, when they realize they're in a bad way, 
instead of matching the situation, that they're just that they're like they're bracing for what they right. conceded this okay, this is this oh my gosh, this is gonna happen. Yeah. yeah. And with a few more pointers from Pete and another lesson learned, we kept on down the river, chasing the sunset on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. As we rounded the bend, the Highway 64 bridge came into view, signaling our transition from the Middle Hall River to the Lower Hall, a section with a few Class 3 rapids that will put my new boat, Betty and I, to the test. It just brings your problems faster to that you. That one wants to hold your line. Okay. So the difference between like a jefe and a jefe, you're facing right now. And that one, it just goes forward because it's got edges. It goes straight. Right. Good for when you're lined up where you want to be. <laughs> Bad for when you change mind. That's what I've discovered about that one. So if you're off track, break it with the, a speed break. Okay. And then start again. But just, it's not going to happen for you otherwise. <laughs> All right, so look, there's going to be big wave trains. It may resemble a hole or two. This water level is not a big deal. It's going to kind of gently curve to the left. Just keep going through all of it. Keep your nose straight. Don't add speed to what you're doing. You won't need it. Just keep your boat straight and then heavy out the bottom. And with that, we entered Gabriel's Bend, a rapid that almost made me feel like I was back out in a mountain gorge. Just beautiful. the guys did a little surfing at Gabriel's Bend, we moved right on to Moose Jaw Falls, a manky, tight rapid that we each took one by one, and I would get my first small taste of what creaking was all about.
we were finally gonna get to see Pete swim. <laughs> <laughs> it's not gonna happen today. So we made it back to the car. Just in the nick of time, just a beautiful time to be outside actually. One of my favorite times. But uh, thanks to Pete on uh, Tea Rescue, I had a dry hair day. Woo! Um, <laughs> not dry hair. But not wet bridges. <laughs> right. The inside of the boat, for the most part, stayed dry. Yeah. He did not have to regret only wearing a dry top. <laughs> right. He was inches from really rethinking that dry top decision. <laughs> but I can confirm that the Hall River tastes amazing. So. <laughs> <laughs> to see a doctor in the morning. Uh, but yeah, like, uh, I have to go with our kids later on. <laughs> <laughs> but it was a great time. Was, I think uh, Betty can officially uh, be broken in and uh yeah good times we'll see you on the next one